Hello, I'm Krista Cuff, and this is the NRA ILA Grassroots News Minute for Friday, December 9th. This week, NRA made it very clear to the United States Senate, the President, and our members that we oppose the nomination of Caitlin Halligan to the United States Court of Appeals for the District of Columbia. On December 5th, NRA ILA's Executive Director Chris W. Cox sent a letter to the United States Senate outlining our opposition to the nomination, and it follows a similar letter that was sent to members of the Senate Judiciary Committee earlier this year. Our opposition is based on Ms. Halligan's attacks on the Second Amendment rights of law-abiding Americans. One specific example includes her work to undermine the Protection of Lawful Commerce and Arms Act enacted in 2005 with strong bipartisan support. This legislation was critically important in ending a wave of lawsuits sponsored by anti-gun organizations and governments, which sought to blame firearms manufacturers and dealers for criminal misuse of their products by third parties. This bill was an essential protection both for Second Amendment rights of honest Americans and for the continued existence of domestic firearms industry as a supplier of arms for our nation's defense. Ms. Halligan previously represented the state of New York in its 2001 lawsuit against numerous gun manufacturers in which the state argued that the legal sale of handguns created a public nuisance under state law. And even after passage of the law, Ms. Halligan participated in the ongoing legal attack on the law. The state filed an amicus brief in the U.S. Court of Appeals for the Second Circuit Court, supporting New York City's attack on the law's constitutionality. The arguments in that brief were ultimately rejected by the Second Circuit, as they have been by every other appellate court and every federal court at any level that has considered the issue. Given Ms. Halligan's clear opposition to a major federal law that was essential to protecting law-abiding Americans' rights to keep and bear arms, as well as an important industry that equips our military and law enforcement personnel, NRA opposes her confirmation to the United States Court of Appeals for the District of Columbia. NRA ILA will continue to oppose this nomination and inform our members of any developments. For more information on this story and for up-to-date legislative alerts, please be sure to visit our website at www.nraila.org.